So uh, next question, I want to know how student loan debt has affected your life since you graduated. So let's start with Bree. Well, um, when you get married, <laughs> what's yours is mine. So uh, <laughs> I got to accumulate somebody else's seven years of college debt um, on top of my own. And luckily enough, uh, because I was in state and I went to a smaller school and I got enough scholarship, kind of enough, um, to take the edge off. Um, we got to combine on it and it wasn't as bad as it could have been. But uh, yeah, it's been... We've been paying it off ever since we got married. So we have been working like dogs to uh, give all of our money back to Sally Mae. Mm -hmm. So how long, how long have you been married and, and how long have you been paying on your debts? And in other words, how long have you been gr from gr graduated? We, um, I graduated the year before him. Um, so I was actually paying my own debts before we got married, um, but we cash flowed our wedding and uh, we've been almost married two years at the end of the month. And we've been, we started paying them the month after we, paying more toward them the month after we got married. So. Welcome to the adult world, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So how has it affected, how has it affected you besides taking on uh, your, your spouse's debt? How's it, how's it affected your lifestyle or your choices on your career, that kind of stuff? Well, we, we live very minimally. Um, we just kind of throw all we can at our debt so that later on we can actually enjoy our money um, in our, our, our life. So it's kind of been working hard and kind of pushing through, not doing as many fun things as everybody else is. We're not buying a house like everybody or new cars. But uh, I mean, honestly, it's not that bad. <laughs> it could be worse. <laughs> yeah, we, we, we came out of school combined with about $70,000 of student loan debt. Um, and, and as of right now, we're down to 12,000. Fantastic. In two years. In two years. In two years. You, you have been rocking it. That's yeah, fantastic. It, it's been no fun. There's no, it's not an understatement when Bree says that, that all we do is pay on the student loan debt. I mean, that's, we don't go out to eat. You know, we have, well, I say that, but we have $25 a month that we're allowed to spend on, on going out to eat. And so we make those. You know, Waterburger and Kane's trips count. Because that's, stretch it that's out. what we did. <laughs> <laughs> you'll, you'll look for the deals. You're like, oh, well, this place has a deal. Okay, well, that's where we're going this month. I'm sorry. Yeah, we're driving across town, say, four cents on a bag of potatoes. What that does for gas money, I don't know. But we're saving money on potatoes, Johnny. <laughs> I'll go to four grocery stores to save money on groceries. I have no shame. <laughs> but but you're doing have, really well, though. You'll be debt free soon. Yes, we by, will. by November. November is our date. You gonna do uh, the debt-free scream? We are. We're actually uh, we're planning a trip back to Nashville as soon as things start opening up again. Uh, to point that out, we are following the, the Dave Ramsey um, uh, program, yeah. and so we're hopefully going to be on air doing the debt-free scream for everybody to hear and celebrate with us on our on our kind of very very long two-year journey to uh, get out from underneath that kind of Wait until it sits on us. I am really proud of you, you guys, because uh, a lot of people would stretch it out over 10 years and just prolong the suffering, but you have hit it hard. <laughs>